Hello, everybody. Welcome to Leet Wine TV. I'm your host, Mark Fusco, here for another episode of the show. Got um, another wine, obviously. <laughs> Someday I'll do like a beer or a, a liquor or something like that. Anyway, um, we kind of need to do one of those. Anyway, so we got uh, Parony Field, uh, Cote de Rhone Village, and this is the 2007... And uh, as the name implies, it comes from the Rhone region of France. It is a 50% blend of Grenache and Syrah. Uh, I'm going to rinse out that oak leaf from earlier. Um, got it for $9.99 at Costco. And according to their website, uh, it got a uh, 91 from Jay Miller. So, got some uh, high hopes for this wine, especially after the last one I did. And, um, yeah, let's check it out. I can already start smelling some stuff. Uh, let's see if there's anything on here that's important. Not really. Okay. Let's check it out. So I'm getting some dark fruits out of here. Definitely already already liking the wine already. Like I said, I got the dark fruits, maybe a little bit of smoke, a hint of smoke maybe. Can I say maybe one more time? Kind of woodsy. And I thought I'm smelling like the wood. It's it's matured in 25% large oak tanks, as they said. 75% in concrete. I'm like, really? Concrete? Okay. So it's not like there's this overpowering of oak, but it's, it kind of gives me a... Kind of like being in the woods. So maybe like a little bit of earthiness. Though I just got a hint of like butter. Which is kind of interesting. I would say smoky, a little smoky, and mostly dark fruits. Let's see how it tastes. It's real, real smooth. Not a huge amount of tannins on it. Um, seems like the mid palate just kind of disappeared on me. So I kind of get that smoke, that smokiness a little bit on the palate. Um, I kind of think it's a little thin. It's really, it's not really, there's it's, it's not much body to it. So I, if somebody else got a 91, maybe that's their style. Um, I tend to have liked a lot of, not a lot, but the rones, the few rones I've had, I tend to have liked. Um, so it's not it's not a bad wine. I don't think I'd go above ninety on this. Uh, honestly, I think it's more of a high eight, well, mid eighties. Mm. I right, so opening up a little more. So I was getting a little concerned. You know, remember wine really takes a little time to open up sometimes, and uh, I'm starting to get those peppers. You know, I love. When you get those peppers, like the jalapenos and, and the green peppers, and uh, I was starting to get that. I think this is going to go with the steaks a little bit better. Now this opened up some more. Um, very light on the tannins. Definitely need to drink this. Uh, now and then, you know, between now and the next um, six to twelve months, uh, it is two thousand seven. It's not meant. It, it was. 
Even the website says drink until about 2010. So I, I agree with that. It's starting to lose a little bit, but it's not a bad wine. Uh, I, I'm going to give it an 86. Um, it's, it's opening up a little more. Probably once we get to dinner uh, in a little bit, maybe about 30 more minutes, it'll open up some more. we got a little more surface area in the bottle. I'll pour a little more in the glass to, uh, to, so it'll breathe a little more. Um, I think it'll improve, and the 86 is really more of a, I, I think that's where the wine will get to once dinner happens, and not because it'll be paired with food, but I think it'll it'll develop more and have more time to interact with with the oxygen in the air. Um, at least I hope there's oxygen in the air. But um, I say 86. I, I don't I don't know if I'd go with 91 necessarily, but uh, for for 9.99. It's uh, it's definitely. A, I think it's a good buy, and I think uh, a lot of people would like it. And uh, it's really easy drinking. Um, so uh, yeah, pretty decent. Uh, let's see what else. Um, as always, friend me up. Leave comments down below. Uh, I do. I do read them. Sometimes it takes me a week or two to get to them. Uh, as as my buddy George, uh, he was the he was the guy who asked me about the iPhone app. And uh, thirty two seconds left. Anyway. Um, so, you know, friend me up, friend me up on Facebook, friend me up on Twitter. Uh, if you see something on the site ad-wise you like, check it out. Maybe there's something there you like, you might want to purchase it. And um, that's going to be it, uh, as always. Oh, and as always, but remember, we're on Monday, Wednesday, Fridays from now on. And uh, Sommelier School was yesterday. Uh, north, let's see, northwest part of Italy was the subject matter, so check it out. Tell your friends about it. Give me some more views. Anyway, that's going to be it. We'll see everybody again next week.